Hello, Klaus here and welcome back to yet another video here at the channel. Last week we had a major update for the Blackmagic Pocket Cinema Line cameras, giving us a lot of new features and in this week we have a not as big update but though an update to the Blackmagic iPhone camera app if you are using your iPhone as a camera and it is a little update giving us things like the ability to use your wireless headphones to use monitoring, some updates to the general stability and also something with the uh, HDMI feed if you are using an HDMI out of the phone into a monitor there is a fix of the latency issues in that some small improvement but there's one very nice improvement and that is the ability to rack focus and in this video I'll just go out in the studio and I'll show you how that works so without further ado let's go out in the studio okay so here we are back in the studio and now I'm just going to show you the rack focus feature and I am screen recording on the phone as well so that will be shown somewhere on screen as well so let's uh, jump down and have a look here we have our subject and um, if you go down to the focus button which are right here we can see that there are this new icon with these three dots and uh, per default you would think that if you push like this triangle one you could set a point and then you would uh, but that's not really how it works how it works is we're going to tap on screen hold your finger and then this is going to appear and then we can kind of set our focus like so so i want r2d2 and c3po to be in focus so i'm going to push one i'm going to push one here and now i've set my focus and then I can go to again here and I'm going to make my second focus on the cup in the back. I'm going to hold again with my finger and I'm going to push two and you can have up to three different focus points but we're only going to have two in this case but nice to have three and then you can basically push one and it will go from that focus point to the second we're going to push two and we can make it even more smooth if we go and click this icon here of the timer we can put it up to three seconds that is the longest focus poll we can make so let's do that we go from the first to the second in three seconds okay so that is the basic of how to set up the rack focus feature inside of the camera app i think it's a nice little update it's not a huge update but it's a nice update anyway i do hope you found this little video useful if you did please hit that subscribe button give the video a like share it with your friends if you think it would help them out and if you want to be notified every time there's a new video on this channel please hit that bell icon down in the corner until next time keep filming keep learning and keep sharing